all in here. Hope you guys got your $3 wells over there. Don't forget about that. It's a special for tonight for all you special people. Again, we got the Colonel Nice TV up in here. We got tactic films up in here, videotaping and everything right now. So if you guys need to walk through here or go to the door or whatever, walk around the table. Walk around the judges' table. So we're filming right here, okay? All right. Thank you. And again, please clean up after yourself. Please don't make a mess. We are all adults here, right? We're all 21 and up here, right? Hopefully we, you know, we will somewhat take care of ourselves. So there's a trash can over there by the bathroom. Please dispose of your trash over there. Not on the floor, not on your table, but in the trash can. Thank you. So here's Corn Dog. Woo! Oh! Yeah! All right, so how you doing, ladies and gentlemen? My name is DJ Corn Dog. Right now I'm usually in a hyphy mood, but life is fucked up because drugs is a motherfucker. Uh, two in the morning Eastern Standard Time, so what's that? Two, one, like midnight Eastern Standard Time, my little cousin Andrew OD. He's gone. Two days before his 21st birthday. Heroin is killing it. No one, you know what's the crazy thing? Heroin's killing it in Seattle, but it's killing it in Cleveland. Cause that's in Cleveland, and that's the second death in my family right now. And I got homie deaths in Washington, so it's a national epidemic. So because of that, I brought this chair. I'm gonna start with an acapella, an old acapella. If you know me, some dope shit. If you don't know me, I'm gonna start it. I'm gonna end it. And if you get what I'm talking about at the end, you're cool. I don't ask or beg you to use me. But you use me anyways because it's a free country. I'm illegal, but in your mind, I'm a miracle. Once we're together, you feel invincible. Until one day, you can't get me. All you get is reality. That when you realize because you used me, you lost everything. Your home is your money. Even your family don't want to look at you because you never leave me. Don't you remember the first time we met? We were introduced to each other by that girl, Beth. And Beth was introduced to me by her parents. Since she was 14, we been kicking it. Back in the day, she slept me in a high school. She had me with the homegirls because they thought I was cool. Until one day, one of her homegirls took me and went 150 on the highway. Her and the family of five died that day. Don't you remember Mike who had that party? Beth invited you, you brought Nick, your best homie. That's what Mike and Beth introduced you to me. From there, we became a happy family. Hell of a good time, she never wanted to say goodbye. But then your money started getting low, so you're forced to say goodbye. You fell in love, so you lost your mind. And from there, your friend Nick stopped coming by. One night, you went to Mike's house with a 38. The friend that thought that I was far away was too hard to take. Mike answered the door. You asked where I was. He told you to go home. You pointed the 38 and began to bust. Killed Mike, grabbed me, drove into the night, got picked up by the cops for driving with no headlights. Found me and the gun, so life was your sentence. To this day, you blame me, and I done nothing. Is it worth the cost to get your mind lost in this game where the drugs are the boss? Is this worth risking your freedom? Cause once the cops catch you, you are done. And is it worth risking your brain through the pain till you forget your name? Now is it worth the cost to get your mind lost in this game where the drugs are the boss? Sometimes I'm natural, sometimes I'm chemical, but in human hands, I'm a pop for good and evil. It fucking sucks to know that it costs an arm and leg to get me from the pharmacy, but I'm dirt cheap in the streets. I see human torture and kill for me. Choose me over the job and family. It's crazy to see a grown man with a broken wife and two babies throw them all away and become a junkie. I want $10 trillion. Fuck that. And who's getting paid the most? 
the government, who used to say I was medicine, the government. I was given to drug lords by the government. And if you think of it, if you think about it, that's the reason for my existence. They get paid by sales and dealers in prison cells. And all you do as people in UV is say, oh well, for that. I'm the problem. And the government going to be our savior. It's going to be like that forever. If y'all don't change your ways. Because I can't do shit. It's y'all fault that we live in these dark days. All I am is a substance. Like food and water. It's not my fault that you use me and go bonkers. I'm created by humans. They're used by humans. They're hated by humans. Y'all humans are stupid. Sadly, nobody wants to take responsibility. All you do is blame me. D-R-U-G. Yo, is it worth the cost to get your mind lost in this game where the drugs are the boss? Is it worth risking your freedom? Because once the cops catch you, you are done. And is it worth risking your brain through the pain till you forget your name? Now, is it worth the cost to get your mind lost? In this game, where the drugs are the boss. I need a cup of water. Can I get a cup of water? Alright, let's start the show. Thank you guys for that moment. I gotta, start, I gotta go though. So I'm not gonna keep it silent for now. I'm just gonna wing it with the cotton. Oh, play some more dresser. Yeah, here we go. Here's your water. Go. Oh, hell yeah. Ah, cool. Ooh, ooh, ooh. It's cool. Ooh, I'm all shaky and shit. Life's a bitch, bro. Know what I'm saying? A lot of people don't even understand that. Life is fucking hard. So what do we do? We do music. You know what I'm saying? Oh, shit, this shit's not working. There we go. Oh, shit. Hold on. I think I know what it is, though. Cool. All right, cool. All right, let's go. All right. Maybe we can turn it up. Fuck it. Oh. Nah, fuck it. As a little down the universe, I made tidal waves with my bars and beats, my music speak. People suck my way for just a bubble when I'm on stage. And the girls can tell the break so the truth can say away. The truth is that we lost our way. We're playing it for us like technology, but you need to build the case around our mind. The dark, we begin tolerances. But how do we use your proof of it? My clutch is sad. Empathetic, I said, everybody was in the Facebook group complaining about nothing. See the truth. Okay, when someone said, what's the point? We see an update on Facebook. That means social media, the crook for all the time it took. I think everybody around me sold this all to be happy with the iPhones and Android. We're great, they're not happy to think that you're crazy. All we do is go to watch and all updates and feed our babies. We're fucking robots. Day in and day out, we can't even come together and hang out and talk about the good old days. We rather just push the like button, yeah. They were all about being in someone's bitch, helping out the same rich. Why we be been broken shit, doing something that I wish was not real. I'd rather reminisce about the days where only homework exists. But fuck that shit ever sucks so I can hear you sit on my butt Using nothing but Wi-Fi and data to scroll down forever and ever Pics and videos and advertisement is my main source of entertainment Having tickets from the past of all five the class of the bracelets Oh, From a playground to a box, that's why we can't connect. That's why we can't connect. That's why we can't connect for the pay phone to the cell phone. That's why we can't connect. That's why we can't connect. That's why we can't connect for playing side by side and playing the lawn. That's why we can't connect. That's why we can't connect. That's why we can't connect. We go kicking, we keep our distance because we can't connect. Because we can't connect. Because we. From a playground to a box, that's why we can't connect. 
That's why we get connected. That's why we get connected for the pay phones and the cell phones. That's why we get connect. That's why we get connect. That's why we get connect for play side by side to play the watch. That's why we get connect. That's why we get connect. That's why we get connect. We don't kick it. We keep our distance because we get connect. Because we get connect. Because we get connect. Yeah, cool, 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 cool. When I say black magic, y'all say no. Black magic, black magic. Black magic, noise! Black magic, noise! You guys are loud, you mother. Whoa! No! No, 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 no! Well, I'm gonna get dunked for that one, that's cool. I'll take that. Cool, fuck it. No, you ain't. Life's always an uphill, we cry for the dollar bill Until you realize to pay taxes like working for cotton bill To make you rich you have to lie to cheat and steal The people that struggle and knows what I speak is real What the ones they don't want up to kind of be bullshit to feel The truth, and with the booth I preach the truth That hopefully will reach to you before they lose their fuck baby too But to do that you have to steal the media And people will have to reach you like an encyclopedia I'm a black man and this is still why the man began to be the young Mexican So they can make fun of us And keep us in a state where we're trapped in the cage While the government don't play in other countries with your names I work on every day to barely make way It's in my fault, hell no But it looks that way Say with the other the ground Me and my community, the working families That have no way to sleep But since we try to get no sleep To be our receipt that we try to keep away from the penitentiaries and wars over countries. We watch it is reality. This is commercial created by machines. Humans are machines created to make cheese. Welcome to the paradise of the father created for us. I want my eyes up for pennies and rock up what the fuck. The only reason I made it this far cause I'm just luck. From the start the game I'm both not going to the same. This sucks. My emotion is full like the ocean. Full like the movement for ocean. The pressure is the motion For I can show I win Because the money was the flowing
just want us to sing in one. Thank you. Continue to create, you know, and be an artist. I, I think that you you have something in you that that can reach people beyond just the music. Real so shit. That's, that's just a personal shit. Real shit. Now on the music, um, it, man, you know, you come with such energy, and I, I and my whole thing is it's not a, it's, and I'm gonna take a little time, so just fight with me. Um, <laughs> this is not a sprint; it's a marathon, and you're set. Like you started off, you know what I mean. You, you started off, he's like, cool, we're about to run it, here it is. But it just kept getting stronger. It's like a train when it leaves this, you know what I mean, the station. It just builds this momentum, bro. And it's, when it's, it's like LeBron going to the rack. You feel me? Like, man, once you get going, it's like, you're going to get ran over. You better move. You know what I mean? And if you ride with me, you ride with me. And I saw you take the audience, man, and they rode with you the whole way. Real shit. Yeah. And, and, and last note, last note. Uh, shout out, shout out to, to, to some town legends, you know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? Julie C, you know what I mean? The homie Germ D. Yo, you are the tribe, you know what I mean? Of the Knox family, bro. You, the way you chopping these bars, bro. Like, I give it up to my sister in here, and she's a town legend. You know what I'm saying, man? You come from that stress tree of the Knox family and, and the real spitters, Alpha P, man. You're an in there, bro. Respect, you know what I mean? Big up. Now, 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 it means a lot, said it means a lot, sincerely. As an artist myself, I appreciate the fact that we have the opportunity to do one of two things. We can soar like eagles or we can crash and burn. And having the opportunity to express ourselves through our music is wonderful. You came out, you made it very clear that you were in a bad state. And the one thing that you needed to do, you needed to vent. Yeah. And so what you did was you dug deep into your heart and you shared it with us. You bared your soul and you shared your heart with us. And that's what real live entertainment is about. It's about sharing a part of yourself with the audience. Nothing more to say. Thank you so much, Corn Dog. Thank you so much.
Certified. We're doing a good deal with this fight, man. We got talent. They doing it for God talent. 